the Yogi government of Up is laying a network of expressways in the state. In the coming time, Uttar Pradesh will be the state with maximum, 13, expressways in the country. This expressway will not only make connectivity and travel easier but will also provide a new impetus to employment. Industrial corridors to be built along their banks will become the medium for this. A provision of 500 crore has also been made in the first budget of Yogi Sarkar 2.0 to develop industrial corridors along all greenfield expressways. Places have also been identified for this along the Bundelkhand, Ganga, and Gorakhpur link expressways. Notification of land acquisition has already been issued in Barghagarar, Kulnawar of Gorakhpur Siddhar Tahsil. Bhagwanpur village of Sahajanhua Tahsil on the banks of 91 km long Gorakhpur Link Expressway. Not only this, the purchase of land in Bhagwanpur and Narukitaha has also been started by Gorakhpur Industrial Development Authority, GIDA. The industrial corridor to be built on the Gorakhpur Link Expressway will have an area of about 1,000 acres. An 88-acre plastic park will also be developed in this area. The approval for this park has been received from the central government. Similarly, APED has been authorized by the government to set up industrial hubs on Ganga Expressway at Meerut, Hapur, Bareilly, Muradabad, Hurdoi, Lukhnau, Kanpur, and Prayagraj. The work of developing the industrial hub is being done at a fast pace by selecting the agency. In this sequence, the process of construction of industrial corridors has been started at Chitrakoot. Banda and Jalau along the Bandail Khand Expressway. The consultant agency has been selected for this. In Chitrakoot, about 103 hectares of land has been identified. Purchase, recapture, and transfer of about 102 hectares of land has also been done. With the development of industrial corridors, opportunities will also be available for establishment of industrial training institutes, educational, and training institutes medical institutes etc. near all the expressways. Expressways will act as a catalyst for the establishment of food processing units, warehousing houses, mandas and milk-based industries. In this way, along with the social and economic development of the affected areas, the project will boost the income of agriculture, commerce, tourism and industries. According to the Rgesh Upadhyay, officer on special duty, Apedda. The expressway project will connect various production units, development centers and agricultural production areas located in the covered areas with other major areas including the capital of the country and will also help in increasing the economic activities of that area.